Texas Democratic Party has come out in support of the decriminalization of marijuana. But Republicans say this is just the Democrats' way of trying to get the young voters before the upcoming election. Fox 7's Lauren Prochowski joins us live from the Capitol with more on this. Lauren. And the Texas Democratic Party wants to make it clear that they do not endorse marijuana use. But in the party's recent 40-page platform, they're calling for a change in the current laws. And while legalizing marijuana in Texas may still be a long ways off, those who would like to see that happen say this is a step in the right direction. The Texas Democratic Party thinks the war on drugs is not working. I think it's a step in the right direction. <laughs> the party's 2012 platform includes the decriminalization of marijuana and calls for wiser law enforcement. A spokesperson for the Texas Democratic Party was not available for an interview, but sent Fox 7 this statement. The Texas Democratic Party does not condone the use of marijuana. Our platform simply recognizes that laws currently in place do nothing to promote public safety or fiscal responsibility. We are calling for policies that are smart on crime and will transition nonviolent individuals from jail and into treatment. Texas Normal, the national organization for the reform of marijuana laws, has been working with the Democratic Party on this platform. What we're trying to promote is a change in the laws so that people who choose to use marijuana aren't arrested, prosecuted, and put in jail. In Austin, the idea is pretty popular, at least with the Austinites we spoke with. I think it's a really good idea because I think a lot of taxpayer money goes towards that when we have a lot of other really pressing issues that, you know, uh, strain, you know, our poverty issues and our economy. I think that uh, probably the majority of the voters in our country um, probably would agree with that, that uh, they would agree with decriminalization. But I think too many politicians are probably afraid to, to say that they're for that. But the Republican Party of Texas believes there's a reason this is all coming out now. It's a disingenuous move to try and win favor among young voters in the election year. The Republican Party of Texas supports the continued enforcement of current drug laws. The restrictions that are there are important to our country, and we feel that they're important as Republicans to maintain those laws. And while decriminalizing marijuana may not happen soon in this state, this move by the Texas Democratic Party certainly has some support. They want to see change. We want to see change, obviously, and I think we can make it happen. Now, the Texas, according to the Texas Democratic Party, the cost of dealing with the war on drugs concerning marijuana exceeds $12 billion annually. The party is urging the president, attorney general, and Congress to support legislation that would decriminalize the possession of marijuana. Back to you.